Keep up the good work. Thank okay, you. Bye. Bye. Hi, I'm Ms Dunlop, Head of Year 7. And I'm Mrs Wake, Student Support Officer. We are the transition team here at High Tunstall. Our job is to get involved in everything transition. We visit primary schools and we speak to pupils and parents to make sure that they are ready for that big step into secondary school. We are always on hand to support and no problem is too small and we are always excited to meet our new Year 7 pupils. Hi everyone, my name is Mr Stewart and I'm Head of Curie House. My job today is to explain to you what the house system actually is and what it represents. Basically, you'll be assigned to one of four houses, Hawking, Turing, Curie or Charmin. And within those four houses, you will have a chance to compete in various competitions throughout the school year. Each subject will have a competition aligned to it. So for example, as a PE teacher, he will have at least one competition throughout the year for you to compete in and you will compete for your house to win uh, points which will accumulate and at the end of the year the house with the most points will win the house cup okay now things that you need to consider you will be assigned to a house so for example if you're in Curie one you're in the best house in the school but two you'll have an opportunity to be part of that house for five years so it's a great opportunity to be part of a team for your stay here at High Tunstall. For some of you, that may be the first team that you've ever represented. For some others, it may be an additional team, but basically you'll have a chance to be part of something quite special um, for your stay with us at High Tunstall. In addition to that, and probably the most important thing, it will give you a chance to create some memories with your peers, um, which hopefully you will, will enjoy. And also, which I think is probably the, the nicest um, thing to consider, you will be able to be part of something outside of education, okay? So rather than just going to lessons, you'll have an opportunity to take part in various different activities, representing your house, enjoying, having fun um, with your classmates, with your housemates, trying to achieve the overall goal of becoming a House Cup champion. Hopefully that sums it all up. Thank you, take care, bye-bye. Hello, my name is Miss Fox and I'm Head of Hawking House. Here at High Tunnels we have a huge range of competitions for you to participate in. They range from the Spelling Bee, to the in-house sport, to the MasterChef competition. And for those budding actors out there, there's also the House Pantomime. These all add up to the house points at the end of the year and they also mean that you can get to know lots of new people and get teamwork and leadership skills. Hello, I'm Miss Smith and I'm the Head of Charming House. At the end of every term, we have a celebration assembly. A celebration assembly is our chance to celebrate everything that you have done across the whole term. We will give awards for punctuality, for attendance. We also have awards for your form star of the term. So that's somebody who's been selected by your tutor in order to be the best representative of your form. We also have a variety of more silly awards, such as Class Clown, or Most Sporty, or Most Chatty, where you'll also be getting a fun reward. The best thing about the assemblies at the end of the term is the fact that they truly celebrate what's best about High Tunstall, and that's the students. We have student performances, we have a lot of the presentation led by the senior students so we really really get a showcase the best of what High Tunstall's got to offer. Hi Year 6, I'm Mrs Watson and I'm Head of Turing House. I'm here to talk to you about our reward system at High Tunstall. Basically over the course of the year you can get achievement points so in lessons if you're producing really good work, you're answering questions, you're doing lots of homework, you get achievement points. You can turn those achievement points into rewards at certain points throughout the year. I'm going to talk you through some of our rewards, which were from the student voice, they've come out quite popular. So firstly, you can turn them into a book. You can turn them into a stationary set of your house. You also can turn them into a canteen voucher. Basically, you can go into the college canteen and exchange this for a brownie. Then we have the sweet boxes. For currently at the moment 800 points, you can change these into some lovely sweets. Obviously, these are the house colours. All right, I'm just going to open one here, and we have a nice sweet box there for you to have. 
Also, you can have some chill out time in this sports hall listening to music during farm time if you wanted to exchange your points for that. And then even better for some people, they get to go on the mugger and play football. So yeah, six, what are you gonna choose? Technologist Stephen Hawking devoted his life to researching the origins and structure of the universe. Hawking had more of neuron disease, but did not let this get in the way of his amazing achievements. Hawking's ethics help us to remember not to let obstacles stand in our way and that we must seize every opportunity to take on new challenges, whatever they may entail. Alan Turing is well known for his pivotal role in intercepting coded messages which helped enable the Allies to defeat the Nazis in World War II. Turing was persecuted for being homosexual in 1952, but Queen Elizabeth granted him a pardon in 2013. Turing shows us that we should approach life with determination, commitment and enthusiasm. Madame Curie overcame various challenges in her life, resulting in her being the first woman to win a Nobel Prize and the first person to win two Nobel Prizes. Curie shows us that no matter who you are and where you are from, you can succeed. Helen Sharman was a chemist who was selected to become the first British astronaut. With hard work and determination, she overcame her rigorous training and succeeded in her mission to achieve her dream. High Tunstall won all students to embrace teamwork, participate in healthy competition, take on responsibilities and applaud the efforts as well as achievements of every individual in the house.